Oh God. Oh God. No, 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 no! This can't be a dead end. This can't be a dead end. Are you serious? Well, final stand. Bring it on, you monster! Bring it on! You think I'm scared of you? I mean, I kind of am, but you know, that's not the point. How could this happen to me? As many of you know, one of my most popular YouTube series is reacting to fan suggestions. And a majority of the time when I do these, y'all send a lot of weird videos. But it's not just you all that are sending the videos. There are some people that I know IRL, otherwise known as my friends, F is for friends who that are sending videos as well. And unfortunately for them, their videos don't tend to make it in. And you know, my friends often tell me that Joe, the video didn't make it in! Oh, Joe, my video never gets selected! But now it is officially time for their day of reckoning! Their day of vindication! vindication. Because today I am doing something very special! Instead of reacting to fan suggestions, we are bopping over to this side of the world and doing reacting to friend suggestions! These are people that I have known for quite a while and people I am extremely close to. Because they've had like, what, six chances and they still haven't gotten one single video into any of the fan suggestions. That is some terrible luck, I'm not gonna lie. You know what I just realized? My fans are gonna be like, Joe, I thought we were your friends. And then they're gonna come up to me and be like, what? Don't you worry, we'll get right back to fan suggestions after this one, okay? I promise. And I have gotten videos from 10 of my friends. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Look at all of them. Aren't they beautiful? I have no idea what kind of videos they've sent me, and I'll be honest with you, I'm really scared. I wonder if they're gonna be funny, or if they're gonna be scary. Ah, they're my friends, they would never do something to hurt me. Wait a minute, that logic is completely flawed, of course they would. But alright everyone, are you ready to get into these videos? Are you prepared to see what lies ahead? Well you better be, cause we're gonna go right in. And up first is a video that was submitted by my friend Goldie. Look at him. Isn't he beautiful? Also, just a disclaimer, none of these pictures are what they look like. This is just a representation of how I feel they look like. I mean, I just thought I'd throw that out there. My friend's actually not a gold bar. At least I don't think he is. Goldie, are you actually a gold bar? Oh, really? Okay. Oh. All right. But apparently this video is called Toby Tries Brain Dance Cyberpunk 2077 by Sigma. At least it's not Sigma. Is this Bully Maguire? Looking a little put out there, input. I feel like they're playing on console, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, all right, okay. Oh my god, what is happening right now? Oh my god, Ricardo! <laughs> I feel like I'm experiencing something that I shouldn't be experiencing right now. Okay, okay. Keep diving in and breathe. Where is he going? What is he doing? What is he doing? Oh my god. <laughs> There's Jameson in the background. Serious? <laughs> okay, alright, Goldie. I just have one question to ask you. What the heck, dude? <laughs> but you know what? I am thoroughly impressed with that editing. Holy crap. I give that two claps out of three. But okay, let's go ahead and move on to the next one. Hopefully there's not a brain dance coming up next. But the next one we're gonna be checking out was submitted by Oxy. You've probably seen him around. He's on my Twitch streams. He's also a mod on my server. Basically, Oxy's a really good lad. But I wonder what fresh hell awaits me by Oxy. <laughs> if it turns out to be wholesome, I will happily apologize. But this video is called My Pet Fly by Zeem Productions. Oh my God, is that, what? What in the? That was actually the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. I have so many questions. How did he get the fly on the rope? How did he get the watermelon juice on the fly? Imagine if this guy brings his pet fly to the park and someone just brought their pet frog. 
Don't you dare hurt the fly, lad. I will actually cry! Also, I like how the description says, also stop asking me how I tie a string to the fly, because I already answered that. It's like we're supposed to come into this video with prior knowledge. How would he do it? But you know what? I gotta say, that was such a wholesome video. That one gets five flies out of five. Zoom, 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 zoom. Okay, let's move on to the next video, shall we? This next one was submitted by my friend Count Olaf, or I, I mean, uh, John. John, I know you're gonna be watching this. I want you to know, I don't apologize for this joke. <laughs> Yes, he submitted this video, and I'm very curious to know what he did. He's probably plotting revenge as we speak. And this one is entitled Monkey. <laughs> it is by Balloonic. Kind of scary that the description is just a sad frowny face. I wonder what this is. Oh, it's, a, it's an actual monkey. Okay. All right. What's he? What are you doing, monkey? Why are you so thick? John, this is a wholesome family-friendly channel. You can't just have a monkey jumping off a tree branch. King Kong when he finds out Godzilla's mom's name is also Martha. <laughs> Spoiler alert for King Kong versus Godzilla. <laughs> you know, I just realized something. After watching all of these meme videos, I'm gonna get a lot of awesome YouTube recommendations. That's pretty pog! Stop spinning. What's wrong with you? Okay, let us go ahead and move on to the next video. This one was submitted by my friend, Tom. It's an easy joke, I had to go for it. But it looks like Tom submitted this new anime plot by Jenna Ty, Ty by Jenna Tiley. What a weeb. Imagine submitting a weeb video. He's looking kinda sus. I got this new anime plot. Basically, uh. there's this high school girl, except she's got huge boobs. Oh, oh. Oh! A real set of donkers. Packing <laughs> some Doban Honkeros. Oh my god! Bank <laughs> Big old Tan Hongera Koo. What? What happens next? Transfer student shows up one day with even bigger Bonk Hanaga Hoos. <laughs> Humongous Hunger Longa No No Logongus. Isn't the English language beautiful? What was that last one even? Hunga Munga. Hold on. Hunga Long with the Badunga Hongagus. That's beautiful. That one gets two hunga malunga lagunga bagungus out of two. Now, Tom, feel free to head out. You're done for today. See you, Tom. Okay, let us go to move on to the next video, shall we? <laughs> and this one was submitted by Courtney. She's the one who made me do that crappy Reddit recipes video. Thanks a lot. Nerd! Me and Courtney have an everlasting feud. I don't think you realize how much this bad blood flows. It's been in our family for generations! So it looks like Courtney submitted... What is this, Courtney? How do you pronounce this? What does it mean in English, bro? Cat sitting! And this was created by... All right, here we go again. Mikhail Shivaldin. Mikhail Shivaldin. Thank you, Google Translate. I appreciate you. All right, what is this? Oh my God. Is that a cat sitting on a ledge? Oh, that is adorable. He's vibing there, dude. He's straight up vibing. I absolutely adore this right now. Oh my god. Bro, he's literally just vibing there. This music is a bop, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I mean, genuinely, I'm not watching the video, I'm just vibing at this point. That was such a good video! You know what, Courtney? For all the hell you've put me through, I appreciate this. I'm just gonna put in the comments with this one, he vibing. <laughs> That music was really good too, I'm not gonna lie. I felt like I was going through an experience there. And that experience was a cat vibing on a ledge. And it was great. But okay, let us go ahead and move on to our next video. Whatever shall it be, because this one was submitted by Elise. If y'all are wondering, yes, that's exactly what she looks like. Number one victory royale, yeah, Fortnite we built. Okay, it looks like she submitted... Son of a gun. Samantha Jack Stopper, covered by John Leashed. Elise? 
I'm gonna punch you in the face. <laughs> you know what? I feel like this Joe and Lee's guy is absolutely epic. And if you haven't subscribed to him, you should probably do that. Who's the new girl? Oh, her? That's Samantha. God oh, dang, that guy's handsome. Oh, his musical vocals are just so good too. Oh my God. In this art style, what more can I say about that? It's beautiful. That was literally the best video I've ever seen in my life. No cap. Literally 10 out of 10. I can't praise this enough. God, I just need to yell it up on top of a mountain. That video was epic! Elise, I just realized something. You have absolutely great taste in YouTubers. But okay, let's go to move on to our next video, which was submitted by Ollie. She's roly poly Ollie. And the video that she submitted is called Company is Coming by Chris Fleming. And I wonder why company is coming over. Please, we're in quarantine. This is a pandemic. Get rid of the couches. We can't let people know we sat. <laughs> I don't care if we have to throw everything out. I I want this place looking like a new Mediterranean fusion restaurant by noon. Ah! I'm not gonna lie, this is a big mood. Bro, I remember when we used to have get-togethers and stuff like that, and I was always super self-conscious of what my place looked like when people would come over. Time to turn into ultra instant cleaning mode. Ah! We cannot have beds. We need more pillows. We cannot we have, have beds. beds. We have to go into the witness protection program. <laughs> Do you think that we often make more of a mess when we're trying to clean something? I never know. Sometimes I look at my living space and I'm just like, what the heck is all of this? Was I raised in a barn? I mean, maybe my parents haven't confirmed nor denied it. Ah, there's a dog in the background. Bro, there's a dog. Get out of the way. There we go. There we go. The dog. Dog is the most important part of this video. I want you to know that. We can't let people know we sit. If people know we're sitting, how are they going to know that we're standing? People can only do one thing at once. People can't chew bubblegum and talk at the same time. And they most certainly cannot speak and sit at the same time. If you think so, you're wrong. When this video first came out, I thought, OMG, it's my mom. Now I realize this is me. Ollie, are you trying to tell me that this is you? Ollie, do you want to know my rating of this video? I'm going to give it a <laughs> out of 10. All right, let us move on to the next video that we're going to be checking out today, which was sent in by Dan. But I wonder what sort of thing he sent to me today. But this video is called Yu-Gi-Oh! It's Time to Duel by Neon Monkey. Return to Monk. Yugi, if you want your precious card back, you'll have to duel me. And if you oh. lose, I get Who's your that? soul. I accept your challenge. Oh, wait, yo, did, did he say he gets his soul? Yeah, that's right. What the... Do don't do that. Why wouldn't you do that? My grandfather gave me that car, Joey. It's precious to me. I just bought you a booster pack at Target. <laughs> You know what? I've legitimately never thought about that. All of this is so easy to find. Also, at the beginning of the series, they mentioned there's only like three blue eyes white dragons in the world. What kind of business strategy is that? Why wouldn't you just mass produce them and let people find them? I mean, it's not like it's hard to print out a card or anything. Also, wouldn't having only one edition of Exodia be like so cringe? And every time you lose life points, 50 buzzsaws will come closer and closer. Oh. And the loser will be hacked into pieces. Oh. What the f***? <laughs> I've never quite realized how just crazy the consequences are in Yu-Gi-Oh. I legitimately think a child loses his soul in the series. What the crap? Your platform will be lowered into a pit of lava. The clock is ticking, Yugi. I wouldn't have it any other way. Wait, Yug, are you getting off on the danger of the situation? Maybe. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <Are you serious? laughs> Don't kink shame me. Oh, my freaking God. The Pharaoh is into some really weird stuff. I'm not going to lie. But like literally every single person in this series is just like, you know what? I don't care what the consequences are. I just want to play my card game. Life or death situation? I am tired of the cards. My grandfather's soul is literally going to be tossed into the shadow realm for all eternity. Part of the cards, baby. Now, you know what? It all makes sense now. All right, let's move on to the next video that was suggested, which is by Nathaniel. And yes, he looks exactly like Jack from Titanic. But did he actually die on the Titanic? I can neither confirm nor deny that. 
He hasn't answered my DMs on it. But it looks like he has submitted How to Catch a Kangaroo by Kookabooga. Oh my god, I absolutely love that channel name. That's so good. Kookabooga. Eekambookum. But you know, I've wondered my entire life how to catch a kangaroo. We shall see how this goes. All right. How to catch a kangaroo. Hello, sir. First, you have to find one in the bush. Okay. Here's one here now. What's happening right now? Can you put it over the kangaroo. What? And it will fall in. Wait, what? And then you have a kangaroo. That is actually the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Bruh, like genuinely, I did not expect that. What? Oh, he catch that kangaroo so easily. Like he was just vibing, then it just hopped in the bag. And it stayed still. I don't understand. What is happening over there? What are y'all doing? I've always wanted a pet kangaroo, but I'm always afraid they're gonna punch me. Like, they seem to be very violent against people. But then I see a video like this and I'm like, it's worth the risk. Guys, if I get killed by a kangaroo, don't mourn me. Just appreciate the fun times that we've had. Uh, death by kangaroo? Yeah, death by kangaroo. Bro, imagine dying by a kangaroo. Life goals. Bucket list. Yes. All right, and the last video of this friend suggestions video is from my best friend, Jamsler. Look at this nerd. Can you believe it? Me and this man have been through some times together. Me and this guy have been best friends for so long. I can't even remember half the adventures we have gotten ourselves into. Me and this guy are friends forever, and I never plan on ever leaving him. He is my bro, and he is amazing. But, uh, Joe, I am about to wreck you right now. This guy submitted an Instagram video. Whenever I asked for these suggestions, I said, hey guys, can you give me a YouTube video? And this mother trucker gave me an Instagram video. <laughs> imagine sending an Instagram video cringe. Can we get hashtag imagine sending an Instagram video when Josh specifically asked for a YouTube video link trending, please? All right, now that I'm done like throwing Joe completely under the bus, that wasn't even just like a push. That was like a, I yeeted him. I literally saw the Instagram video link that he sent me. I was like, bro, I'm giving you so much crap in this video. <laughs> so he's mentally prepared. It's okay. Oh my God, Joe. God dang it. What is this frame? Joe, what are you having me watch right now? Why is it from the God Master Hentai? Joe, you are a degenerate. <laughs> oh my god, what is gonna happen right now? What is this? Oh no. Oh, he's a camera! Oh my god! It's bad. I, I, oh. <laughs> my bro just got his ribs cracked and she's over there chuckling like everything's okay! Miss the snow laughing matter. He really wants those pictures, doesn't he? Oh my god, the degeneracy! They freaking struggle! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, like he's like, yes, I finally got him! What we don't know is that he's been struggling to do that for many millennia. Can we get an F in the chat, please? Thank you very much! But you know what, Joe? I'm gonna go ahead and give this video here five bonks out of five! But uh, yeah, that's a very interesting last video to have. How do I explain this to YouTube? <laughs> Thank you everyone very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I had a very good time. Finally, my friends have been able to make it into a reacting to video. And I gotta admit, every single one of those videos were just so good. I, oh man, they were just amazing. And I'm pretty sure all my fans now are just asking, when's the next fan suggest this video, Ja? Honestly, I'll probably do it in about a month. So be looking at my community page for the next fan suggest this video. Yes, yeah, spots are gonna be limited whenever that does come out. So be sure to be on the lookout for that one. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, hit that like button and hit that subscribe button and be on the lookout for some more epic videos to come in the future. If you're already subscribed, consider becoming a member by hitting that join button down below or hitting the top right of the screen to check out my Teesprings merch shop. If you don't do any of those things, I would, would, what's wrong with you? But yes, thank you all so much for watching. I will see you on the next video. And of course, you all stay awesome. No, YouTube, it's a Nerf gun. It's a Nerf gun, see?